On the subject of education tonight, parents have more questions than answers about the future of education in and around Gardendale. We've told you a judge ruled Gardendale can form its own school district as long as leaders meet some requirements. CBS 42 News reporter Michael Clark live in Gardendale where board members held a special meeting tonight. And Michael, it was a quick meeting, at least for the viewing public, huh? Yeah, that's right. Parents only saw board members for about 10 minutes or so where they were read a statement about what's going on. But for the past three hours or so, board members have been behind closed doors in executive session going over the judge's ruling about 190 pages worth for the first time. The possibility of a new school district in Gardendale. Frustrated, um, worried because I, you know, I don't know what, you know, what, what the future holds as far as the education for my children. Brings mixed emotions for parents. Rather local people that deal with our kids have more to do with this than somebody sitting in an office downtown. In a federal judge's ruling, the Gardendale board can only operate Gardendale and Snow Rogers Elementary for now. If the board is successful and can comply with other orders in the ruling, it could fully separate from Jefferson County Schools within three years. We've been wanting a pathway now for three years, and uh, through the federal court, we've received that. So uh, I would say that uh, we're pleased with the outcome. For parents like Dustin Howard with kids outside city limits, there are now even more questions about what will happen when they reach middle and high school. My fifth grader will go through the, the, the middle school here. Um, that'll cover her three years up until her freshman year of high school. Whether she's in Gardendale or going somewhere else, we don't know. Superintendent Patrick Martin says leaders are working to come up with solutions, appealing the ruling and discussing the costs of paying the county for Gardendale High School, all topics up for debate in the executive session, even though officials say no decisions will be made tonight. This really is the first opportunity for Gardendale to sit down collectively and look over the document together. Now, also a part of the judge's ruling, an African-American resident must be appointed to the local school board within 60 days. That's something else board members said they'll be discussing in the near future. Reporting live in Gardendale tonight, Michael Clark, CBS 42 News, local coverage you can count on.